All right, guys, so as freelancers, we work. Oh. All right, so as freelancers, we need to use tools and applications to make our job easier, right? Uh, me personally, I have a tool to manage my finances and a tool to communicate with clients and to send emails and to monitor projects and to update clients on projects. I mean, the list is literally endless. And really why all those tools are super important and there are some that I like more than others, I pretty much found that they're interchangeable. If there's one that I like, chances are there's a, a handful of other tools that do basically the same thing, right? They're interchangeable. Now, the reason that I bring this up is in my whole time as a freelancer, there has only ever been one application that is absolutely irreplaceable in my business, okay? Now, that is an application called Webflow, and it literally has changed everything I do in my business, and it literally, when I implement it into my business, it doubled the amount of money I was making almost overnight. So if you don't know what Webflow is, Webflow is a in-browser web design tool that allows you to create websites and web applications. And the best part is Webflow is designed for freelancers and it makes our job way easier. When I started my freelance business um, just about two years ago, I was building almost all of my websites in Wix and in WordPress, okay? Now, if you've used these two, you know that Wix is kind of like the, the, the simple, basic, um, drag and drop type web designer. And then you've got WordPress, which is a bit more complex. It's got all the different plugins and moving parts. And, and while, you know, in my opinion, it's a little too confusing, um, you definitely can build something more complex and more complete for your client, especially if they're needing something a little bit more custom. Um, and, and I was just frustrated because it was either too basic and didn't look professional or it was too complex and it just took a long time. Um, and I was charging a good amount for these websites, several hundred dollars, obviously I was just getting started, but I was just frustrated because I felt like my work just was either, you know, it wasn't top notch work or it was just taking way too much time for what I was charging. Um, and that was when I decided that I needed to find something that could really take my, my work to the next level and, and not only look more professional, but be more time efficient. And so I could really just bust those things out. And that was when I found Webflow. When I found Webflow, I was just blown away right off the bat. It was unlike any web design tool I'd ever use. And I used a lot of different ones, right? Um, but right when I found it, I was just like hooked, okay? I, I spent the next week or two doing nothing but just tinkering around in Webflow and seeing how all the features worked and how the, the you know, the different sections and things you could do and the, the animations. And it was just, I mean, it was really mind blowing for me. And, and so my very first client that I got after I found Webflow, I was just committed to build their website in Webflow. And immediately just off of the way that the site looked and functioned and all of the features, it was so easy for me to charge more. And I literally charged nearly double what I normally did. And the client didn't even bat an eye. Now, while that, I'm sure a lot of that had to do with just my confidence and pricing, and I was still figuring things out early on, there's no question that it's easier to charge more when you know that your work is professional. And that's what Webflow did for me. So that's the first thing that I wanna talk about. And, and really, it's at the core of why I love Webflow so much, is as a designer, I want my work to look good and if you're anything like me, sometimes I can be a little bit of a perfectionist and I'm frustrated with the way certain parts of the site look. And, and sometimes it's hard for me just to like wrap up a project and say like this is done. Um, but with Webflow, you literally can create the most gorgeous websites. Um, they just look awesome. They're, they're clean and they're clear and they're easy to, to structure and get your layout. And, and every bit of it just looks more professional than any other drag and drop design tool that you can use. Um, and, and that's what I love about it. every single website that I deliver, I feel like is just at a, a higher caliber than, than my work was before. And it's raised my confidence to raise my prices. And, and, and really at the end of the day, I just want to deliver good work. I want my clients to love my work. I want somebody to visit those websites and say, wow, this is an awesome site. I wonder who built this. Um, and that's what you get when you design with Webflow. The next thing that I love about using Webflow is it literally gives you the capability to make the site look any way that you want it to. Okay, now that was one thing that I, I always struggled with um, in the other web design tools that I was using 
is you were just limited. Um, even like the, the desktop version was limited, but especially when you got down to the mobile version, it was like really all you could do is adjust the spacing and padding and, and things like that. But you really couldn't like have complete control over the way the, the mobile version worked. And that was frustrating because mobile's most important, honestly, that's what everybody's using. And in Webflow, it's, it's incredible because you have the exact same design capabilities in the mobile version as you do in the tablet version and the desktop version. You literally can do anything you want. And, and if you wanted to, you literally can make the, the mobile version a completely different website than the desktop version. Like you have complete control. And, and not only that, but the speed at which you can, can make those changes is just like untouchable. Um, I, I literally went from spending 10, 20, 30 hours on a website um, to being able to bust out an incredible website in three, four, five hours. Now, the last thing that I wanna talk about is, is primarily the reasons that Webflow is good for freelancers. Um, and that is every, you know, every step of the way from your you know, beginning to design the site to delivering the site, uh, it just makes it so smooth for you and the client. So the way that it works is you can publish it on a, just like a temporary domain, like a lot of other design tools and, and you know, your client can follow along with your work. Um, but the thing that I love is once you, you finish it and publish and deliver your site, um, Webflow has a lot of different features just to make that go smoothly. And for me, one of the biggest things that I was running into with my past clients is I would finish the website and then they were calling me every week saying, I don't know how to make these changes or you need to change this for me or add this picture or this text or whatever it was. Uh, and I felt like my work was just never done. And, and yes, I should have set better expectations and, and you can charge clients for additional work like that. Um, but that's kind of besides the point. Um, the biggest thing that I love about Webflow is once you deliver it, it has a custom CMS um, software. So that means it's, it's content management system. So once you deliver it, you send the client an email where they can create an account and log into a dashboard and literally have complete control of everything that's going on there in their website. So they can, um, from the visual, like, visual standpoint of looking at the website, they can change text, they can edit links, they can move pictures and, and change them and whatever they want to do, they have complete control and it's really easy to make those changes. But even more importantly, you can set up a, a backend CMS where when they want to add a blog article, they can type it in on their dashboard, press publish, and it automatically updates that into their website. So it literally eliminates you having to go in and redesign a new page for a new article. Literally everything is just fluid and easy to update. So once you finish the site, you just pass it on to your client and you're good to go. So you guys can see that I love Webflow and I want you to know that this isn't an affiliate video. I'm not getting paid to, um, to push Webflow on you guys, but really it is an irreplaceable tool for me. It's a tool that um, more than doubled my business within the matter of a couple of weeks. It's helped me provide better work. Um, it's helped me get happier clients, find new clients, and it's helped me make more money and just be happier with the work that I'm doing. Um, and that to me is priceless. And so over the coming videos, I want to talk about everything from how to use Webflow and how to, to develop beautiful sites that, that function properly and that can generate leads, but also the administrative side of things. Um, we're going to talk about how to connect a domain and how to sell clients on hosting and how to deliver a site and everything in between because I truly believe that this is a, a software and a design tool that can help take your business to another level and it's scalable. It's easy to, to bring team members on and, and work with Webflow and, and it's just an awesome, awesome thing to understand and to implement into your business. And so we're gonna talk about all of that and I look forward to, to connecting with those of you that either haven't ever used Webflow and are just getting started. And also those of you that have been with Webflow from the start, uh, I know there's a lot that we're gonna be able to learn together and it's going to not only improve uh, our business and make us more money, but it's gonna help us be happier with the type of work that we're delivering to our clients. And I look forward to that and we'll talk to y'all soon.